thinking about the way Leibniz and Newton related to their respective followers, they were very different in that too. Leibniz was engaged in open communication through letters that were published in journals with a group of people, the Bernoulli brothers, Jacob and Johann Bernoulli, with Christian Huygens, uh, with others, with L'Hopital. These people wrote to each other, but their letters were published, and so they were public. And so there was a public discourse going on around Leibniz. In Newton's case, it was very different. He didn't publish his papers. He was prepared to show his papers to his followers. You could almost call them disciples in Newton's case. They were Newton's acolytes. And to his favoured disciples, he would show some of his papers, allow them to take them away, even copy them. And so in that sense, he was undergoing a form of pub publication, but it's a very private, very controlled form of publication only to the people that he really wants to have his, his gems.